Hey YouTube, this is uh, Big Country Time. I'm back with some uh, more mystery boxes and a few store purchases. So uh, today I'm going to show you uh, a purchase from the Funko Shop, one from um, the Funko Shop, one from Amazon, and a couple purchases I got from Target. And I have uh, one. It was a $15 box from uh, Shumi, and I got a mystery box that I purchased from Geeky Mama Bear. So before we get to the two mystery boxes, we will do the store purchases. So uh, I think a lot of people saw this one come out a few weeks ago. So uh, pick this one up. Um, Pretty cool R2-D2. I like the fact that it's all uh, worn and dirty from the scene in, uh, I think it was uh, Return of the Jedi, or is it, uh, no, it's not Return of Empire Strikes Back. So obviously this is when it's in the swamp, it got all dirty. So it's a cool one. I think this is my third different R2-D2. So I'll pick that up at Target. Yeah, it wasn't the best. I was working, my wife picked it up for me, and there's like a, you can see a little tear up in there. So, hopefully I can pick up another better box. And I was kind of hesitant to pick up this last one. Um, it's not one of the best ones from the Mandalorian. Um, but uh, it was at the store, I was just sitting there, ended up picking it up. Um, it's the client. So I pretty much have every other uh, pop from this set. So this is like the last one I picked up. So like I said, I wasn't originally gonna buy it, but uh, it was a good box. So, and it was only eight bucks at Target. So not bad. So I'll add those up to, uh, to the wall of uh, Star Wars pops. So every every time I'm getting Star Wars pops, I'm constantly changing up my uh, my setup. So uh, you can see up here they're kind of mixed up from the last uh, last time. I uh, did the bands for arm um, Star Wars boxes and picked up six Star Wars pops I hadn't had yet. So I had to uh, move around a lot of different pops around. So um, go with. Uh, Let's see, we'll do the Funko Shop next. So it's just uh, one purchase. I'm not sure which one it is. Seems like every every week a different pop is coming in. So here we got, this is gonna be the World Pops. So this is the one from uh, Mexico. This is gonna be the Chihuahua. So there's that, pretty colorful, got the pin in there, so this is uh, number 5 of the set, there's a total of 12, so you can see all of them up there, and you can see behind me, got the first 4 up there, uh, maybe, uh, yeah, you can just barely see the, the bottom of them, right up here, so uh, make some room up there, I'll put that up there. So uh, I'll probably get the whole set of that as they come out. All right, next we got a uh, Amazon purchase. So it's a little of a bigger, bigger box. Box is in pretty good shape. No major uh, damage to it. Oh, okay. So uh, there's no uh, no packaging material in it. But this is the Wampa. So, here we go. These uh, 40th Anniversary Empire Strikes Pack pops are pretty cool. So, as you can see, they're going to have a few of these uh, bigger size pops coming out. So this one's gonna go right up there with uh, 
We got Luke, we got Han Solo, we got Princess Leia up there, so I'm gonna make some room. We'll put this one back up there. I think it'll go perfect with uh, those ones up there. So I'll do that off camera, make some room. All right, so um, I got two mystery boxes. They're uh, I'm assuming it's gonna be one pop and uh, one from Geeky Mama Bear. I think it's one or two pops. So we'll do uh, the best for last. We'll save uh, the Geeky Mama Bear's box for the last one. So we'll get the Shumi. So I keep getting these uh, Shumi boxes, hoping uh, that I get the top pick, which is Captain Rex. Haven't had nothing major. And now uh, I think Shumi's going to no uh, soft protectors on any of these now. So hopefully if it is the top pick, it does have some type of protector on it. But uh, so if you guys see my videos before, um, Shumi is pretty close to me. I usually pick it up. So you can see in-store pickup. Makes it nice. I don't have to pay the extra on the shipping and handling. Oh, what the heck? No, I don't remember ordering this one. All right, so it's not the Captain Rex. It is a Diamond Collection um, Ursula. So that's not a bad pop. I like, uh, I like Ursula. So I have another Ursula down here. A little bit different. So you can see the different style to Ursula, so I do collect Ursula, so that's a cool pop. I'm not sure what the value is. It would probably be pretty close to uh, even dollar if I pay $15 in tax. So uh, let's see what um, this one comes up on value-wise, and then we'll get to Geeky Mama Bear. All right, so uh, exclusive to Hot Topic. The one I'm seeing on here on PPG is not showing the sticker. It shows $16. I assume that's the one. It's released in 2017. So pretty much broke even, but uh, it's a keeper, so that's cool. Um, all right, so we'll go to uh, the Geeky Mama Bears box. So I'm not sure if you guys have uh heard of Kiki Mama Bear. She's a fellow YouTuber. I'll include her uh, YouTube channel and her Instagram channel down below. Got my lucky number right here, 29. So hopefully, uh, hopefully we get uh, one of the top picks. Uh, I don't think she had many Star Wars ones on there that uh, I don't already have. But I think there was a, um, an X-Men pop, which uh, I think was a Wolverine, which I wouldn't mind getting. But I uh, just wanted to uh, support, support her. So I bought one of her boxes. And she got this thing super taped up. Nothing's coming out of here. So I got two pops. And cool. Got her sticker, so I'll add that up there with my uh, my collection. I haven't really got a board or anything yet started, but uh, got her sticker. Got Sean Ryan's sticker. We got the Luau. Hey, that's that's all the stickers you need, right? Those three. All right. So she got some sorters in here. I don't think these sorters are which pops I have. So. We'll see. All right. All right, I'm not sure. Let's see. This is the top. The Walking Dead. I think you say her name, Mashoni. Mashoni. And she's got the values from the date she boxed them up. She has it valued at fourteen dollars. So this is actually my first Walking Dead pop. I don't really click Walking Dead. I watched the show for probably, I don't know, five or six seasons and 
finally just got burned out but this is pretty cool she's got blood on the blade if you watch the show you know she's pretty famous for having that machete so we'll check out the value after opening the other one to see if it uh, gained or lost value since she boxed them all right all right go to the last one looks like this is on the bottom Magneto. So I said uh, I was looking for an X Men pop. Didn't get uh, the Wolverine, but I got Magneto. This is a pretty cool one. I like Magneto. I don't have any uh, X Men pops yet, I don't think. You look back, look back. Oh, uh, what? I have Cyclops. So I'll have that one back with that. I have the 80 year Cyclops. I think that's the only X-Men pop I have. Yep. So she has this down at valued of $10 as of five, five nine. So you can see that. All right. So we'll just check it out of curiosity, see if uh, the value went up or down. So there's a Magneto um, Hot Topic exclusive. That came out in 2014. And then there's the common also in 2014. And it, and it shows $12 on PPG. So uh, not bad. $12. It went up $2. Cool. And then we'll check out the, I think, like you said, Mashoni. All right, so it shows 14, so no change on this one. There's a few other cool-looking ones. Uh, exclusive to Harrison Comics was uh, the Bloody Box. That one's like $49. $49. That'd be cool. But uh, not bad. So uh, I think I paid. I think I paid $25. I can't remember, but. Uh, so I got 12 and 14, so broke even. Not bad. And like I said, just pretty much did it to uh, support her and her channel. So uh, like I said, I'll put the link in the, in the bottom. If you haven't uh, already uh, subscribed to her or seen her videos, go to her channel, check her out. She's awesome. She loves, uh, she loves Star Wars. So uh, um, kind of have something in common right there. But uh, also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, like the video, throw some comments down there. All of that uh, plays into uh, helping promote my channel. So uh, obviously I get a lot more views than I have subscribers a lot of times. So uh, if you're watching, just hit the little subscribe button and I said uh, it'll help uh, promote my videos. Um, so that's pretty much it for today. That was just a short, quick one. Um, I'll be having another video coming out after this. Probably be another bands for arm uh, battle between me and my daughter. I got another, um, I think another 10, 10 boxes waiting to be opened that uh, possibly could be holding that uh, Freddy Funko as uh, as Yoda. I'm hoping to get that or the, the um, Captain Rex. So those are the ones I've been wanting. Captain Rex, the General Grievous. Those would be my... Uh, my top three pulls. Uh, those are my top three grails. Uh, also, wouldn't mind getting some uh, holographic uh, Star Wars pops to put up there with my Emperor Palpatine. But uh, you know, it'll it'll happen eventually. We'll get there. But uh, this is Big Country time. I'll be signing off. We'll see you on the next video. Bye.